This video focuses on finding and generating patterns with fractions with adding. This problem requires a lot of reading, so we're going to chunk it to make sure we do all the steps. The first chunk says, generate a pattern of at least 13 fractions by adding 4 thirds to 1 third, and then continuing to add 4 thirds to each fraction. So there's a lot in that problem. We need 13 fractions total, and for every fraction starting with 1 third, we have to add 4 thirds on it. They actually did the first one for us. 1 third plus 4 thirds is 5 thirds. And keep going. 9 thirds, 13 thirds, 17 thirds, 21 thirds, 25 thirds, 29 thirds, 33, nope, yep, 33 thirds, 37 thirds, 41 thirds, and 45 thirds, and that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, and we need one more for 13 total, 49 thirds. The next chunk says, circle each fraction equal to a whole number. So I have to go through and circle the fractions that when divided equal out to be a whole number. So that I do that by dividing the bottom number to the top. So 5 divided by 3, that's not even. But 9 divided by 3 is, and I would get 3. And so the fractions that would happen with 21 divided by 3 is 7. 33 divided by 3 is 11, and 45 divided by 3 is 15. All the others, if you divide them by 3, have a remainder. So it's not just a whole number. The next step wants us to write what we notice about the pattern of the whole numbers. And if I look at these numbers, there's a couple different patterns we can see. One pattern is that the whole numbers have added four in between. Three plus seven is, or three plus four is seven. Seven plus four is 11. 11 plus four is 15. So one pattern is the value of the whole numbers increase by four. Another pattern we see is that the whole numbers 3, 7, 11, and 15 are all odd. So we have made a pattern, found the pattern, and answered the question. 